How can two strains of cannabis have the same terpene profile but very different aromas? Science time. Historically, we've used terpenes as a catch-all term for many factors of cannabis, including aromas. The scientists at Abstract studied hash rosin and discovered far more depth than previously captured. Their work centered around expanding the map of cannabis chemistry. They used hash because of its ability to preserve flavor and aroma. Through this, they discovered an entirely new category of molecules in cannabis called flavorants. They identified at least three new flavorant classes, including tropicana sulfur compounds, canna sulfur compounds, heterocyclic compounds, and more. First, they found canna sulfur compounds, which produces the dank, the gas, the skunk. Some of these CSCs had never been seen in nature before, but the chemical structure closely resembles that of garlic. Next, they found tropicana sulfur compounds. These produce exotic citrus, tangy, and tropical notes in cannabis. Then, they found heterocyclic compounds. These provide a rich, savory chemical scent. Heterocyclic compounds include indole and scatol. Scatol is found in human feces. Scatol also serves as an aromatic multiplier. Having any scatol significantly increases the aromatic effect of the other notes, which is why it's used in perfume and cologne, all of which make up the wonderful new world of flavorants, the category you should be talking about.